This is tuna on toast. And how does that work for guys like you who have so many songs? And some of these songs, if we're going back to like Fungus Among Us or Science, and you maybe want to dig one up or two from that era, is your brain, can it just go, whoop, my hands go like this? Or how it's, does it work? It's really interesting that you asked that question because, you know, a lot of, especially the older that I get, I go back and have to sort of like relearn um, certain songs. And um, like, I realized that a lot of my playing is like a lot more technical than I ever like sort of realized before. So I'm having to kind of like, relearn to how to play parts that I wrote when I was like, you know, 19, 20 years old, or I just play them in a way that's like super difficult. Like maybe it could be easier, but I just played it in a really difficult way. But then this muscle memory thing starts kicking in after I like, I'll go through it a few times. Like I've, and it'll feel like I'm like, Oh my God, I've never even, it's like, I've never even played it before. And then like a few times in, it's like, Oh yeah, that's where my finger used to go. That's how it, that's how you do it. And then it just like something kicks in. And it's wow. so, it's so interesting. Like, like there are even songs where I hear them, um, you know, obviously some, many of our songs, um, sort of the, the more, um, identifiable, recognizable Incubus songs, the ones that people really know, like, you know, we've played those so many times that like, that's like whatever, but some of the, like, you know, sort of deeper cuts, it's like, I hear them back and I'm like, it's almost like I'm hearing them for the first time. I'm like, oh yeah. Oh yeah, we wrote that. That's crazy. Like, and, and then playing it is the same way too. It's like, I have to acclimate. It's not just like instant recall. Like it used to be when I was younger. So yeah, it's just so interesting. You hinted at something a couple times and I want to just do a somewhat deep dive into it. When you listen to songs that you guys wrote when you were somewhere between, let's just say 19 to 23 years old. And that was science. You, and, and here you are in your forties. You are surprised by how good some of the songs are now, technically looking back. Um, and I'm not saying, oh, I'm yeah, great yeah, or anything yeah, like that. Yeah, like, like just to give you an example, Brandon sang a lot of things in like a register that's probably really, really, really difficult to do. Mm. And now it's like, oh shit, like <laughs> how are we going to do this? But, you know, like he, he like trains like full on, like really like works really hard at it. And it was always like really effortless for me but now i'm like damn i gotta i gotta i gotta get i gotta step it up a little bit because it's right. it, it it's funny like what just comes naturally to you as a 20 year old versus you know like when you're in your 40s and after like they say the warranty expires at age 40 so it's, <laughs> no, no 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 don't say that don't say that <laughs> yeah it's a it, it's it's just a trip you know like doing this for such a long period of time and, you know, here we are in 2022, um, you know, playing concerts and I mean, to we, a lot of people to very yeah. big audiences, man. It's pretty crazy. Hope you enjoyed. Now hit that subscribe button. And for more Tuna on Toast, listen wherever you get your podcasts.